I'm going to read Clifford's movie, The Star of the Show. A carnival came to Birdwell Island. Emily Elizabeth went with Clifford. She rode the Ferris wheel. Clifford met T-Bone and Cleo. This place is the best, said T-Bone. There's so much food. Look, said Clifford, an animal show. Let's check it out, said Cleo. The lights went out. A spotlight came on. Hello, my name is Larry. I am proud to present the most amazing animals ever. Rodrigo lifted a barbell. It was bigger than he was. Dirk zoomed by on his rocket skates. Welcome, Dorothy the High Wire Heifer, said Larry. And now here's the star of our show, Shackelford the Flying Ferret. Shackelford swooped down on a trapeze swing. He landed on Dorothy's head and juggled. A balloon made Dorothy lose her balance. <clears throat> That was really good, said T-Bone. Want to join our show, asked Shackleford. We are entering a talent contest. The prize is all tummy yummies you can eat. No, thank you, said Clifford. He did not want to leave Emily Elizabeth. Clifford called Emily Elizabeth breakfast. Feeding Clifford must be a big problem, said Mr. Bleakman. Clifford is not a problem, said Mr. Howard. He's family, but Clifford didn't hear him. What's wrong, asked T-Bone. I eat too much, said Clifford. I'm joining the animal show, Clifford said. I want to win tummy yummies. You're not going without us, said Cleo. Clifford, called Emily Elizabeth. Where are you? Look, Paul Prince, said Charlie. I think he left the island. Clifford, Cleo, and T-Bone found the carnival. Larry was happy to see them. Need a home, asked Larry. They wagged their tails. The next show didn't go well. It's Big Red to the rescue, said Larry. The crowd cheered. Dorothy told Clifford a secret. I'm afraid of heights, she said. Clifford had an idea. Hop on, he said. This isn't scary, said Dorothy. It's fine. Welcome back to the Tummy Yummies contest, said the announcer. Clifford is on TV, said Emily Elizabeth. Larry's amazing animals were a big success. And the winner is Larry's Amazing Animal Show. Emily Elizabeth and her parents brought Clifford, T-Bone, and Cleo home. Now they had enough tummy yummies to last a lifetime. Clifford stepped in a puddle. Splash! Clifford! shouted Mr. Bleakman. But then he smiled. It's good to have you back, boy, he said. Welcome home, Clifford, said Emily Elizabeth. Woof, said Clifford. He was very happy to be back on Birdwell Island with all the family and friends he loved. The end. Thank you.